the future of Birmingham is food. Uh, so what do I mean by that? We're not going to become this agrarian paradise. Uh, we're not going to have urban farming everywhere. But food is going to be the thing that changes Birmingham and alters its future for the better. If you think about it, uh, that simple picture that I took at that food truck has uh, represented something for me anyway. Uh, it's, it's one of the areas of the city where you are inclined to see uh, about a third laborers, uh, a third hipsters, and a third business people. It's, it's one of the most egalitarian areas that you're going to come across in the city. Uh, every little food truck is like its own little railroad park in Birmingham, uh, having just the right mix of people, having a good diverse group of people, and having a group of people all getting along and communing around something. Uh, it's been that way for a long time, and, and, and I'm going to take that from the present, and I'm going to go back to the past. The, the, the images of segregation in Birmingham, the images of segregation in the city, uh, often very violent, but the ones that stand out are the ones that seem so innocuous. The, uh, the restrooms, the lunch counters, where people could be eating together, but were prevented from doing so. Uh, and that, in and of itself, was part of the abomination. But, but then you look to the future, and and I see a future for downtown. I see a downtown that has been trying to grow and trying to build its culture and try to bring people together for a very long time. And what's the piece that is the linchpin that is really going to spur a renaissance in downtown Birmingham and bringing people in? It's the Publix. It's the grocery store. It's food. You put the kind of food in there that brings people together, and people can't help but be together. So there's your answer. It's food.